Alrighty guys, what is going on here everybody? Welcome back once again to another episode here by Fishing South Jersey. Um, I'm at my local lake today, and today I've got another sponsor for today's video. Um, once again guys, Placenta Fishing has sponsored today's video, and, and they really supported the channel lately, and I really am appreciative of their support. Um, today, I'm going to be reviewing their actual first, like, legit spinning rod. Not a telescopic rod, it's an actual legit spinning rod. Um, this is like the prototype model right now. They sent it to me. It's no, not in stock yet on Amazon, but it will be though eventually. I'll most likely upload this video when it's in stock so you guys can go check it out. But it's going to be a $30 spinning rod and I'm holding the prototype right now. This is a 7 foot model. It feels amazing. It's lightweight. Um, it's very sensitive and it looks like it's going to be a fantastic rod. Um, I got it paired up on one of my spinning reels, 10 pound braid. I'm going to be throwing a little spinner here so you can catch some fish just to start off the evening. Then I might switch over to my other rod, throw top water around so you can catch some fish here. Pretty stoked. Let's get right into it. Oh my gosh. This hook barely threw a flap of skin. Just come right out, watch this. Yeah, that's fish number two. Not a bad fish right there. <laughs> it's alright, use this a slime rocket. There's a fish on the pickerel, or on the worm. I hook my pants, which is fantastic. Sun is starting to set though guys, so I might tie on a top water before I get some top water action for you. I did not bring the chesty, so you're not going to be able to see the blobs. That's up, but here, throw it. That was a sick blow. 
miss the eating that looks like that. Set the hook from a kayak. Ugh. Come here, buddy. Don't, don't bite me. Don't bite me. Don't bite me. Don't bite me. I'll get you back in the water. There he is. He's not a bass. I thought that was a bass the way it hit. Well, there he goes. But first frogfish of the year. Caught that on that little baby pad crasher. It's a junior pad crasher. So it's a smaller size frog. Because like last year, I really noticed I was missing a lot of fish, and I think it was mainly because the frogs that I was using were too big. I need to, I need to buy more of these. So this is the only one I have. I saw him wake behind it and then he came up and just destroyed it. 